poured into U.S. ports, and the tales they told filled Southern whites with absolute terror. On December 21, 1816, a remarkable gathering of men met in Washington, D.C. There were Quakers who detested slavery and slaveholders who detested free blacks. Together, they formed the American Colonization Society. Its purpose? To send free blacks to Africa to reduce the possibility of slave revolt in the U.S. and also to extend what they called the civilizing influence of Christianity to the black continent. Members of the organization included Bushford Washington, nephew of George Washington, Francis Scott Key, who wrote The Star Spangled Banner, and James Monroe, future president of the United States. Most free blacks were deeply suspicious of the group's motives, yet some joined the enterprise despite their misgivings. Others felt that once in Africa, 